Professor, I'd like to take a different approach to this interview. I like different. I want to write about the Einstein no one knows. Einstein the husband and father. Then you would be handing your editor a paragraph. I married Maleva, we had two sons. My eldest son has children, thus I have grandchildren. After divorcing Maleva, I married Elsa. Now I am a widower, and here we are. Uh, you met Maleva at Swiss Polytechnic. She was the only woman admitted, so she must have been very intelligent. Unfortunately, not quite enough. She failed her final exams twice. Oh. Still, she must have been a great help to you constructing your theory of relativity. Maleva would be the first to admit she checked my calculations. <laughs> that is all she did. Besides raising your two sons. Of course. You divorced in 1919? I cannot remember dates. I do not memorize anything I can look up. <laughs> Your sons were very young. It must have been difficult for them. Divorce is difficult for everyone. Of course, especially if their father remarries only three months later. Margaret, have you ever married? Why do you ask? Because marriage is the unsuccessful attempt to make something permanent out of an accident. You did it twice. Are you accident prone? <laughs> I must be.